need no need for dramatics. The guy's 0-2. Next time he'll try to send somebody bigger. This is what happens when COE turns to niggas getting punched out in the STRIP. Niggas getting punched out in the strip club. So anyway, Big Caesar little bro runs into Joe Budden last week. See the word? What up, man? Pizza, pizza. What's up? What's up? Joe Buttons? What's up, Buttons? What's up, Pizza Pizza? You see Mr. Buttons? What's up, Joey Buttons? Tough guy? Tough guy? Nothing Buttons? Hey, Buttons, Buttons? What's up, Pizza Pizza, you corny ass nigga? And ever since then, it's kind of been open season on Joe Budden. People have been clowning him, the whole bear mace thing, the whole COE, all that kind of stuff. So I guess Tax Stone, Mr. 35 to Life, kind of gets a, a win of everything going on. So he thinks it's open season on Joe. So he sent some dirty goons at him in the strip club, and they kind of beat on him. And Joe kind of speaks on it. Um, and it's Queen's Flip Live right here. Then the goons snitching themselves and going Instagram and right. When a worker gets a boss touch, that's tough. So, only people that would actually understand that that um that context and that caption are people who are on the Joe Bunny Patreon or they you know watch all his podcasts and all that kind of stuff or they watch Math Hoffa. So pretty much, what started to be between Math Hoffa, not Math Hoffa, um Tax Stone and Joe Budden was that I think I believe Joe Budden went on uh, Math Hoffa. And Matt Hoffa asked him, like, yo, who 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 motivated you? Who'd you look up to? Was it Tax Stone? Was it this person? Was it that person? Joe Buddy was pretty much like, no, I looked up to Combat Jack. That was the owner of the network because I wanted to be more. I wanted to be a network owner, not just a podcaster. Tax Stone was just a podcaster. He was more so a worker, a podcaster. Combat Jack was the actual boss. So I guess that's what started the whole beef right there, whatever, all that kind of shit. Now, Joe Budden goes on homie's pick who wrote that in the caption and writes i ate that punch and broke my hand on your face y'all should learn how to fight <sighs> look man joe you can't be fighting with some of these bums dog some of these bums in the hood they have nothing to lose and they will clap you in a second dog you're a millionaire now i understand that you have some bravado you want to be tough you but it's not worth it, dog. It is not worth it to be fighting some of these dudes. They have nothing to lose. They will kill you and your whole family for nothing. You got way too much to lose. You seen what happened to King Bond, Young Dolph. Haven't we learned from these rappers who got killed from just messing around? A lot of these podcasters believe that, yo, I'm a podcaster. I'm on video. I just talk. I can't nobody. But nah, we can be touched. That's the reality of it, dog. And Joe is my dude. I'm signed up to $25 Patreon. I've been watching him for since 2018 now. Every single podcast, I haven't missed nothing. I wouldn't want nothing to happen to him, dog. The network he's building is amazing, dog. Stay out the streets, man. Go to strip clubs in Philly or something like that. But New York is hot right now. Just keep it cool that you know, things get better. You feel me? Digital thugs him out. Like, comment, subscribe. Thank you for watching.